Yo, what is up guys? In this video, I'll be showing you guys today um, sorting up the Jupiter and the Moon. So, it's a real, it's not a clickbait or something like that. So I'm on my room right now, so I can show you. I'm shooting with my camera, Nikon Coolpix um, L820, okay? So, how we could find this uh, planet? So it's uh, terrible to you guys, I know that. So, you guys are seeing there, this uh, over here, as you guys can see, there is a little bit a dot shape like that for you. It's a Jupiter, and over here on the point, it's the moon, okay? And how we are going to track this thing, and are we sure about this? This is Jupiter or not? You guys might be asking, and I'm definitely 110% sure because we can use the application from your Android app these days to track this thing. So I'm using the Stellarium app and if you guys don't know what is Stellarium, I will keep the link in the description and just install the app, okay? So let me launch the Stellarium right now. Okay, so this is a Stellarium. So this is how your app should look like. So this is the Stellarium. And all you need to do is you want to set the time on the exact match okay so right now it's 2021 20, it's exact 8 o'clock um it's exact 8 p.m right here it's night here as you guys can see and all you need to do is you want to press on here okay this button sorry for the plane guys and you want to uh, use a gyro proxy sensor your your Android gives you a new gyro proxy sensor that lets you track, okay? Um, uh, that lets you um, move your device. You guys can even, um, you know, just launch for the satellite or another planet as well. So I'm just going to be using the gyro proxy. Just tap on that, and as you guys can see, this is on now real time. So as you guys can see, not this. These are the Jupiter and Moon. So this is a real time, okay, guys? So, um, but. I will say that, guys, um, from my camera, I can just zoom to Jupiter and show you just um, a few moons, okay, just about two moons. But if you guys want to see all the four to five moons, then you guys need to switch to um, another Nikon uh, product. And I will give you the link in the description, you guys can buy that. And you guys can zoom even, you know, Saturn and Venus, Mars, whatever yeah, you guys like to zoom, okay? Because it contains 100x zoom, whereas my camera have just 30x zoom, and I can't zoom too much, and I can just show you this is the proof that how you can uh, find the planets. So this is a Jupiter, as you guys can see, it's written Jupiter. Sorry for this blurriness, I don't know why it's getting maybe of the exposure or something. So let's get dive into this video right now. So I'm on the same position, so yeah, let's go. I have just found uh, the Jupiter right now, as you guys can um, see over here. Let me unzoom. Okay, so here is the Jupiter and Moon. So even you guys can, you know, pause this and you guys can capture all the Moon, just like that. And we are not going to show it on this mobile. I'm going to show you that on by zooming this. Okay, so let's go. And guys, just I zoom uh, the Moon because. I was not been able to fix the aperture, so this is the full zoom of the moon, and I have already, and I have already been showing you on my previous video as well, the zooming of the moon. It's really clear, as you guys can see. Uh, I don't know what is this. Okay, so uh, we are basically going to show you right now uh, the Jupiter. Okay, so let's unzoom this right now. I don't know how much it's been on zoom. All right, so there is a Jupiter. So let's zoom the Jupiter right now. And uh, okay, so as you guys can see, this is a Jupiter, and there is a two moon. As you guys can see, or not, but I am looking here a two moon. Um, basically, uh, the Jupiter do have four moon, two, four or five moon. Okay, I'm not sure about that. And you guys can uh, watch this on the Stellarium app, okay? It's really cool. It gives you the brief detail uh, while you are going to zoom. So I can't shoot, as I have already told you guys, I can't clearly shoot this because I do just have 30x zoom lens. So if you guys want to zoom this and bring the clear footage, then I recommend you guys to buy Nikon Cool PX P900. It is the really crazy 
zooming lens um, camera you guys can get 100x zoom with that camera and you guys can get more details with sharp images okay so you must um, get that I think so it's a uh, 120 or 150x zoom I'm not sure about that okay I'll be uh, putting all the specification also in the link in description um, you guys can check uh, my caption her my description you guys can just go ahead and ch check that out so this is a Jupiter so let me full on zoom and show you I'm on my room right now it's really windy and I don't have the lock on my door and I'm just using like that shade so let's zoom this on Again. so previously I can't uh, you know zoom and I can't do from the previous because um, the exposure setting was not set on the manual and this camera don't have the manual setting as well so I just recommend you guys to buy that camera okay so as you guys can see this is the moon once again and here we go let's unzoom let's moon unzoom it so we'll forget to zoom on the Jupiter so let's zoom again Jupiter and this video is going really uh, you know longer and I, and I can't shoot for a longer time because I just do have two minutes for you guys because my SD card has been really fooled because I do have the old footage of these old um, moons and Jupiter's Saturns all about that so actually we can shoot um, you know from this camera um, if you guys don't have a telescope and it's no worry about that okay so you guys can shoot um, with this camera it's a digital camera not even a DSLR and just use this app okay it's called the Stellarium and the application link will be in my description down below so this is how it looked like okay guys so I can't focus this because I don't know as you guys can see it's on a blur mode and sorry about that so this is how you can see that so really easy to zoom and do whatever you guys I know you like so I can zoom the Jupiter from my room it's really easy so it's not for easy for you maybe because your location is uh, completely different from mine so you, you guys need to research about um, the planets just like this okay so bye for now guys and I'll be catching you guys in the next video so peace out